It's a sound of suburbia, a leaf blower in a nice neighborhood, but it was also the trigger for the latest in an epidemic of senseless shootings. It happened in the Chicago suburb of Antioch. Police say a 79-year-old man was so upset over his neighbor's loud leaf blower, he shot him dead. 59-year-old William Marty's body was found in his neighbor's driveway. A gas-powered leaf blower like this can create over 90 decibels of noise. That's enough to damage eardrums. In fact, many cities have banned leaf blowers like this because of noise. But a motive for an alleged murder? That's got many people asking, what is going on? Dr. Keith Ablo says America is facing a mental health crisis. People emerging from the pandemic, people coping with economic pressures, people dealing with all manner of substance abuse and everything else, can be literally on the edge at any time. And there's an $80,000 reward for the capture of the suspect wanted for shooting to death five neighbors over a very different noise complaint. Police say 39-year-old Francisco Oropesa, who's been deported four times, was asked to quit target practice in his yard near Houston so that an infant could sleep. Instead, he allegedly went to his neighbor's house and shot the victims, including an eight-year-old boy trying to protect his mom. My heart... is with this eight-year-old little boy. I don't, I don't care if he was here legally. I don't care if he was here illegally. He was in my county. Five people died in my county. Grieving relatives of the victims gathered for a memorial service, the latest in the spate of senseless shootings over senseless reasons shaking the nation knocking on a door by mistake, or going down the wrong driveway, or a basketball that rolls into a front lawn. I don't see relief in sight. Be careful. <laughs>